We've gotten our hands on the latest leaked news. Big kudos to the Pipeline Discord channel for getting us these details as early as we can. So in this one, it's quite a few things that I want to go through here. The very first one is going to be pertaining to salvage changes that's been um, going to be coming in with a 322 build here, right? So the first one here says salvage printers now hold RMC and construction components in a buffer and the vulture has a 14 seu buffer while the reclaimer has a 720 seu buffer that's interesting so the reclaimer's printer can now dispense large boxes so that is interesting instead of the small boxes we're going to be getting larger boxes and um what this means is you'll be able to salvage for a long period of time without actually having to especially with the voucher go back and um actually uh dispense the actual boxes so this is actually going to be really good this is going to be really good for the gameplay itself i think this is a good change before we move forward i'd like y'all to know that the channel goal for the end of the year is 10,000 subscribers and we cannot do it without you guys if you do watch the content of this channel regularly please do me a favor and hit the subscribe button let's move on so up next here is hall munching it says here it's harvested as construction components right now they were unable to find out how much these cost once uh, you salvage them because of server instability but i'm sure we'll find out soon okay so to activate this with the vulture is alt w and to activate it in reclaimer you need to be in the co-pilot c it says currently the claw for the reclaimer is currently broken. So hopefully it's fixed once we actually get their hands on it. I'll be really interested to see what this thing finally looks like in action. All right. So what, what they also mentioned here is it's relatively it's a relatively quick process where the player uses a fracturing beam to break apart a ship. See, unknown if large ships require more. After this, the player can absorb these small pieces in where they're vacuumed similar to mining. Interesting, interesting. It's a relatively rudimentary mechanic, but this is a good start. It's a, it's a new way to make some money in the salvage career. It says the animation for deconstruction is likely not final. So we'll have to see how this looks once we actually get this into at least a PT build, okay? So in other news, CIG does intend to drop two patches one for 3.21 with the replication layer which actually just did drop and we're going to go over the patch notes very shortly and they also intend to drop a 3.22 evo Cadi build patch all right so with the 3.21 it's meant to be testing uh, the second phase of replication layer which is exciting let's see uh how this performs this time around we also heard some news that there could be possibly a new Mirai ship called the Mirai Pulse, but we'll have to see. The hair, the hair coming in Alpha 3.22 is looking fantastic. Cannot wait till we actually see it. All right, so let's move on into the patch notes for the 321 Evo Cardi build for replication layer. Okay, so what they have here is uh, server crash recovery. It says server crash recovery is implemented in this test. The recovery process may take a long time, five to 15 minutes, and we ask that if possible, people stay connected and wait it out. Some or many game systems may show odd behavior after recovery, such as being in a different location or loss of state. There's a bit of known issues and I'm not gonna go through that here, but they do have some fixes since the last replication layer test. The very first one is this area in Teaser Spaceport is completely missing. The second one here is player unable to die in a 80 player test um, and it says needs verification here. It also says here players will not be able to log out of their ship's bed properly and will be booted into space. Alright so I'm glad that they have that fixed. It says here mission does not get accepted when viewed in the accepted tab within the contract manager that's fixed. Mineable rocks turned invisible on approach. All right. So in regards to the testing schedule, it says the playtest schedule uh, to start at uh, to be determined and run for about four hours in the tech preview channel on US servers. Only during this playtest, 
play as normal keep in mind the known issues above the network team will be in spectrum and watching service throughout the test so any questions here or etf testing chat might be addressed just to let y'all know my organization phase one industries is recruiting new and veteran players if you're interested you can find our discord in the description down below make sure to leave a like subscribe i'll see you on the next video